Hi guys, I have myself a little mini talon here, 1300mm wingspan from Banggood. This is the kit version, so I get to put it together and put all my own gear on it. This is an excellent weight carrying FPV platform with a rear motor and a V-tail. Really interesting little plane. Let's have a look at it. So here's the fuselage in two pieces. We have some reinforcing down the inside there. Center section there, which needs to be strengthened. If you look at everyone else's reviews, the two vertical stabilizers or V-tail. And really chunky, chubby little wings. Parcel of uh, plywood bits, uh, Allen keys, bolts, and things like that. A few decals, a bit of a, an instruction pamphlet. And finally we have a thick spar and a thin spar. So it'll be fun putting this all together. I'm using five minute epoxy to glue together the wing mount box made of plywood. And uh, the spars do pass through those little holes so you have to sort of make sure there's no excess glue in there. Using CA glue for the FPV nose pod, again plywood. These are the nuts that the canopy bolts go into. I didn't actually end up using the uh, bolts to hold the canopy down. I was just using tape, using hot glue for that and the motor mount and the little uh, landing skeg and the uh, wing spar box as well, just gluing that into one side. Now I'm going to glue the two sides together with Gorilla Glue, so I need a bit of moisture uh, and then spreading the Gorilla Glue over all the uh, mating halves. And Gorilla Glue does foam up and can force the halves apart, so you need to uh, clamp the two halves together and I'm using electrical tape for that. And you just have to leave it overnight for it to cure. Fuselage is all gone together nicely. Uh, the wing is just <coughs> sitting there, tails are just sitting there at the moment. Now it's time to talk about the uh, components. So my strategy for this build is to keep it as light as possible. So everything down on the tail has to be super light. So I've got this Sunny Sky 2212 980 kV. That should be good. Uh, 40 amp ESC, which I will uh, extend these the three wires here so I can put the ESC forward of the CG again to keep it light just some lightweight 9 gram servos down on the tail and I have some uh, digital Metal Gear servos to put in for the ailerons uh, receiver is going to be an X8R FR Sky receiver I'm going to set this up and fly it and see how I like it. If I really, really like it and I decide I want to use it for FPV, then I'm going to put an Air 3 uh, flight control board on. And instead of using the cheapo servos, I would change to something decent like the uh, Carbon Bird KST fast digital servos, which uh, give the best performance with these sorts of flight control boards. Push rods. Uh Preformed control horns are good, they're nice, strong, good quality control horns. They just need to be glued in there, so I just have to make sure that is very well glued in and maybe even reinforced a little bit around the outside as well. But I'm happy with them. The supplied linkage adjusters aren't all that much use really uh, because they're supplied with a little normal nut. All you're going to do is tighten it up against the control horn what you actually need is like this one here a little bit of no thread so what I'm going to have to do with these ones is use a, a, a nylock nut rather than a normal nut uh, so that it's going to be still free pivoting it's a bit too tight now so I'll back it off a little bit that's perfect not too much slack either so that's okay
I need to strengthen up this part of the, the little hatch here that's very very poorly designed never never designed to work so I've got a little bit of ID card plastic here that I'll just hot glue on and that will do a good job excellent now the final touch before we actually go and lob it is just to lightly glue the wings in because I may want to pull them apart later on a little bit of hot glue and a bit of tape and that'll be as good as I need it that's all ready to go now with a 4S3000 battery is all I need to balance it and it doesn't even have to be right up on the nose and the all up weight is 1120 grams so 1.12 kilograms that's nice and light